BMW just released the retail ordering guide for the 2024 BMW X5M and the X6M. They're going into production for April of 2023, a little bit early because they're getting the facelift with the new iDrive 8 screen. I'm gonna walk you guys through the retail ordering guide here in Canada so you guys know what the base MSRP is and any changes from the 2023 model year. Let's get into it. Okay, so the first page on the product bulletin, we're gonna see here the engine is moving over to the S68, so the new updated BMW M engine with a new 48 volt mild hybrid technology. It's also gonna be starting production of April of 2023. Now moving into the next page of the product bulletin, base MSRP was increased by $5,400 on the X5M and $5,300 on the X6M. Now metallic paintwork did decrease by $450. Drive by gray used to be $1,450 last year. Same thing with Tanzanite blue, which is now gone. And frozen pure gray does join the ordering guide at $6,000, which last year wasn't on the ordering guide, but individual paints were only $4,900 for frozen paints. Now, the upholstery stays almost the exact same with one change. They did remove the night blue interior and replaced it with the ivory white and atlas gray. Now, premium package does have a few changes. First, it was decreased in price by $750. We then have the new travel and comfort system added in. We have auto four zone climate control now part of the premium package versus being a standard feature last year. Wireless device charging is now put into the package versus being a standalone option. And I've also noticed that they removed the driving assistant professional or the advanced driver assistance package active stop and go cruise control is now no longer part of that premium package the m enhanced package that includes the carbon fiber engine cover mirror caps and the rear spoiler on the x6m did increase by 650 dollars for each unit now moving on to the next page, the ultimate package did also decrease by $750, just like the premium package. Looks like inside everything is the exact same with the new individual ash full and gray open pour wood trim as an option on this one. The advanced driver's assistance package is new this year. It's a $2,000 option, and that's going to give you the driving assistant professional, which is the active stop and go cruise control. Now moving on, we come into the standalone options that you can add. It looks like we have three different wheel options that you can get for the X5 and the X6M this year. Last year, you only had the one option and it looks like the 818, you can now get in jet black burnished or just jet black. All of them are gonna come with the performance non-run flat tires. Everything else seems to be saying the exact same. Shadowline headlights is a new option for the facelift. And then also that wireless device charging tray was removed. But other than that, it looks like it's pretty much the same, except for the fact that those individual paints at the bottom, both increased by $1,100 from last year. And then we start moving into the new standard features. Now really the only thing I noticed is the adaptive LED headlights are new versus laser lights and the BMW curved display screen is new with the iDrive 8 system. Now on the last page of the ordering guide, we have the two new wheel options. You're going to have the 818 in pure black and you're going to have the 808 wheels. Those are going to be the two new options versus last year. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys appreciate this BMW content. If you're in the Toronto Marketplace and you're looking to order an X5M or an X6M, feel free to send me an email. I'll have that down below in the description of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next video.